Assalamualaikum sahabat fakta islami Bagaimana kabar kalian semuanya? Semoga selalu sehat dan selalu dirahmati oleh Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Among the countries that I no longer travel to Is India <laughs> Because while India is a member of BRICS And India is proud of her friendship and alliance with Russia. India has now become Israel's most strategic ally, ally in the world. I think India is more important than the United States now to Israel. Uh, I quoted to you from Surah uh, Ma'idah, but I only, did not quote the whole ayah. I only quoted the second part that you have to look for those who are going to be your allies and I said that your natural ally would be the one who is closest in love and affection for you okay that is the surah surah al maida uh, towards the end of the surah however before that the ayah begins with a statement la tajidanna أشد الناس عداوة للذين آمنوا اليهود that you will most certainly find in time to come as you found at the time of the Prophet والسلام, is fair mudaria that those who will be the most hostile of all people to you would be the Jews This happened in the time of the Prophet ﷺ. And then for a thousand years after that, we had no problems with the Jews. No. We, had, we protected the Jews in our civilization. And then came the emergence of the Zionist movement. At the same time when the body of Fir'aun was discovered. And now the Jews have become the people with the greatest hatred for us. Exactly as Allah has said in the Quran. But he goes on to say, وَالَّذِينَ أَشْرَكُوا That in addition to the Jews, there will be another people who will have the greatest hatred in their hearts for you. Now while there are Hindus whose hearts are not corrupted with hatred for Muslims, while there are Hindus who are sincerely I don't blame them at all. Sincerely puzzled and troubled with 800 years of Muslim rule over Hindu India. Hmm? And they cannot stomach it. If I was a Hindu, I would also be tremendously troubled over 800 years of Muslim rule over India. Because it was not Islam. It was Islamic imperialism ruling over India. And uh, I would oppose it. If I were a Hindu, I would oppose that Muslim rule over India. And if I were an Orthodox Christian, I would hate the Ottoman Empire. Oh yes. And hate Islam because this is Islam, Ottoman Empire. If I were an Orthodox Christian, I can't blame the Orthodox Christian for his hatred for Islam because of what the Ottoman Empire did. And I can't blame the Hindu as well. Because what Islam, what these, Orthodox, these Muslims did, the, the Mughals, was to impose Islamic imperialism upon India. So yes, you have to make a distinction between those Hindus whose hearts are troubled by this Muslim imperialism, but who are a people who do not have uh, genital hatred for Islam inside of them. There are another Hindu people who are like that. And it, Allah is referring to these Hindus. The same way as in Britain, in France, in Germany, you find Christians who are decent people. Yes. You find Christians who don't like what the government is doing at all. And then you find other Christians who are very, very much uh, seeped in hatred for Islam. So Allah is saying in the Quran that in addition to al yahud there'll be another people who will show the greatest hatred for you in Akhir Zaman, and these are people of shirk. Hindu India 
that part of Hindu India which is hostile to Islam falls in that category. Terima kasih sudah menyaksikan video ini, semoga bermanfaat bagi kita semua. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.